Alright, so nagbabalik tayo for another vlog. Alright, so it's been a while since our last vlog and today we are going to unbox and give our first impressions and review for a new set of strings no, sent over by Stringer PHN. So thank you to all the people, especially to Sir Roy of Stringer PH for sending uh, this package out. No? They were reaching out to mga musicians and uh, string players specifically who wants to try out this new set of strings. So, hindi ko muna sabihin kung ano. Let's open the package and see exactly what these strings are. So, ayan yung package natin. Let's open it. Okay, so inside we have a new set of Larsen Il Canone uh, soloist strings. Yan. So, ito yung pinaka packaging niya. And we'll look into it more hands on later. Uh, pero ito yung laman ng ating package. And it's still sealed. Ayun. Ang ganda ng uh, presentation. No? So, this has a free. Uh, e string, yeah. So this is their new product, the Il Canone Soloist. So if you've tried the Il Canone set by Larsen, maganda yung naging response ng mga colleagues ko, and I tried it as well, no? I haven't tried this particular one since it's new, so bagong labas lang din siya. We'll put it on our instrument and then we'll test it out. Okay, so let's do a quick unboxing, unpacking ng package na to. So, let's open it up and let's check the contents inside. Yeah. So, it says it's all about the music. When we open the package, we get... This limited edition uh, QR code yeah. and then we get this Il Canone E string two sets of the E string and then the soloist A, D and G strings okay so ikakabit ko siya sa violin ko and then we'll try it out do some uh, sound samples and all para makita natin kung gaano kaganda yung strings na to. restring new instrument so I have the Il Canone Soloist on uh, I use the standard E string not the 0.28 E string because uh, according to uh, Stringer PH though and uh, the original or the package that you will get will include the standard E string no? if you want to buy uh, a set of strings so must Mas pinili ko ilagay standard so that you could actually hear what uh, the standard strings would sound like. Okay, so right off the bat, nakita natin kanina yung packaging. The packaging is great. What I like most about the packaging is that all the strings, even the E string, comes in uh, this plastic. No? Sabi na iba parang overkill. But I think it preserves the quality of the strings better. Especially here in our country, diba? We're in a very tropical climate, so nagiging uh, problem yung storage, no? A lot of us don't like to store their strings, so kailangan on the go, bibili ka, minsan makukutulan ka, wala kang stock. So I think you could stock up on it, no? Pero syempre may, ano rin, may lifespan din yung strings, but just adding this no, on all the strings, kahit sa E string, would 
really make a huge difference on storage no? and help us out in keeping our instruments and our strings in tip-top shape. Okay, so first impressions, no? and nawawala-wala pa siya sa tono, no? is maganda yung sound niya as soon as I put it on. It doesn't sound as harsh, no? Sometimes kasi when we put on new strings, diba? it would sound overly metallic, no? Very piercing to the ears, yung sound niya. Once we start playing on strings that are uh, new. But this one, when I start play, then playing on it, no? Kahit bago pa lang siya, it's not as metallic. Walang masyadong harsh sound that came out. But it's very, very loud, no? I don't know if the mic of my camera could show you how loud it is. Pero... Fresh na fresh pa yung wala pa sa tono, di ba? I don't know the break-in time would be, but I'll try to play on it uh, as as long as I can para malaman natin kung gaano kabilis lang siya mag-break-in or how how long would it take. But yeah, first impressions is the sound is really powerful, well-rounded, no? I, I mean, you should expect that from premium strings like this one. feel on the fingerboard it's quite on the softer side if you like that feel no uh, i could compare it to uh, other brands like peter infeld yung feeling niya on the string it's very soft yet the bow response is immediate no paglapat mo pa lang ng bow it, or, it already picks up uh, exactly what you want to to get out from it. Yeah. So maganda yung response niya, maganda yung quality. Now, things that we can't cover on this vlog, unfortunately, is one longevity. How long will these strings last? So stay tuned. Gagawan ulit natin ng video on longevity and of course how it reacts over time. No, siguro sa longevity. And yeah, the overall sound quality. Kasi strings change, no? Kailangan ba natin i-break in? Ba ba natin ba natin? So, those factors we can really test out right now but, yeah, the sound is really nice for me. Sobrang ganda na. strings are quite soft that's why medyo nahihirapan siyang ma-stretch agad because I think I put on less than 30 minutes pa lang naman but yeah overall sound quality is great 
overall uh, color, tone color, volume is really loud. For me, ah, medyo nung una, nagulat ako nung <laughs> pagka-stroke ko pa lang nung uh, strings. No, if you watch my Instagram live earlier. Uh, pero yun nga, medyo pierce, hindi naman siya piercing, but it's relatively loud. No, so, medyo baka ma-overwhelm ka if you're not used to these types of strings. Okay? Ngayon, pag-usapan natin price point. Um, the El Canone uh, Soloist is priced at 4,500 or I'll put the, the price right here. So around less than 5,000 pesos. No? So it competes directly with, I think, yung other brands, premium top choices. No? So this one really, I think, if it would be uh, durable, and have good longevity. You could use this as your go-to strings, no? Pero of course, these types of strings usually usually ginagamit siya for special occasions like for example, may mga concerts kang upcoming if you are going to play. Yun nga, for soloists, of course, no? So, if you want to try it out, the price point I think is good, no? Medyo hindi naman siya super over the top in pricing na. but it's of course a high-end string so expect high-end uh, premium prices but I think it's worth it if you really want to hear a good quality sound and of course if you are going to use it in in concerts no if magsasolo ka if kunwari magre-recital ka if you are a student if you want to try it out no, so there's another premium option available for you. No? Not not saying na pangit yung iba, but of course these new strings that are coming out are being developed for the modern uh, use cases. No, so mas uh, masabi natin na mas madali siyang gamitin, no? and hopefully they last longer. So I think in Dominant Pro Scan that I reviewed a few months ago or a few years, I don't know, medyo matagal na rin yata, it lasted me a couple of years, I think, na hindi naman masyado nagde-deteriorate yung sound. But of course, you have to have proper maintenance with your instrument, proper maintenance with your strings, para mas maganda yung maging quality ng sound that you get. And of course, the quality of the product that you are uh, creating or the sound that you are creating. Ayan. So, worth it ba siya? You can try it out for yourself. No? I'll put uh, the Shopee link of Stringer PH down on the description box below. Again, thank you to Sir Roy of Stringer PH for reaching out and for helping me create this content and of course for the strings. No? So, overall, I think everyone who will try this out will be satisfied. But of course, it will all depend on the quality of sound you're looking for. And of course, the way your instrument would react as well on the strings. No? So, medyo high-end nga yung strings natin. So, uh, expect to pay, pay that premium. No? May premium price talaga siya. But if you're an advanced student, no? trying out strings for your instruments, maybe try out Il Canone Soloist by Larsen. And I think that's all for this vlog. No? Of course, keep yourself posted for more updates on the strings. No? All the links you need to follow are all down in the description box below. So just check them out. No? And of course, subscribe to my YouTube channel for more content. And I'll see you on the next one.